videos all the time, but... <laughs> <laughs> really? Yeah. His I mean, kid sucks, but he likes it. Okay. Oh, no. Do you go out and play with him at all, or is it... Yeah, no, that's why I, I, I go out and uh, play some. Uh, by the way, uh, how is uh, the cultural program uh, going with Nakasen? It's been, it's been really, really good. I mean, you know, I think the number of... Uh, Young people have been joining the <coughs> drumming classes. It's really expanded a lot, mm -hmm. and um, you know, I think it might be something that maybe Min might be interested in in, in partaking in. I know he hasn't. Oh, you know, so you do also provide a, a cultural program for a little child? Yeah, too. yeah, oh, that's great. Yeah, I mean, it's 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 really open for for folks and you know, right. if you like to come by and you know, right. Right. I, I remember you sent me the flyer. I didn't. didn't Look at it carefully, but yeah, I'll, I'll check it out. Yeah, that that's would, great. That'd be great. And so what's up? So I, <laughs> <laughs> I, I really well. Thanks for you know sitting down and talking. I haven't seen you in a while, so it'd be good to get to catch up. Mm -hmm. um, you know, I really wanted to thank you and appreciate you know all your support over the years. Um, I know that our fundraiser last fall was uh, turned out really great because of your because of your contribution. Mm -hmm. How much did you guys raise? Uh, we raised about we raised about uh, twenty five thousand uh, dollars. Net. It was a uh, it was net. Um, <laughs> so what are you gonna do with that money? <laughs> um, <laughs> that's a really good question. I think what we're gonna do, you know, what we usually do is goes back into the program. So our programs like uh, our cultural pro uh, like our Puma troops, mm -hmm. and making sure that they get uh, new instruments and mm -hmm. uniforms. And a new thing that we're really trying to build out and. Um, you know, as part of our work is, you know, development of the new senior center. I don't know if you've heard <coughs> much about it. This far. Have you heard anything about no, this? No, yet? not really. Okay. Um, well, we, um, you know, as part of the, you know, work in building community and you know, definitely like cultural um, classes are a part of it, you know, we really think it's important for, um, you know, all the senior members uh, that we work with have, you know, access to you know, a good like housing and you know, that and um, you know, it, it's 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 really important in an area like Koreatown because you know, it's so high. You know, I don't know, you know, where your where your grandparents are at right now, but I know that um, you know, you know, uh, the people that we work with that their grandparents are currently struggling right now to find sort of good affordable housing. So you're trying to build a senior housing. Yeah. Well, so sounds like a big project. So where are you at this point? So right now, you know, we're in a good position. Mm -hmm. um, you know, we just secured the permit to actually build on this site. But, oh, that's great. You know, one of the things that we're we're looking at right now is how how to really raise you know raise the money. To mm -hmm. the site, mm -hmm. How know? much are you trying to raise? So right now we have a target targeted goal for ten thousand wow, um, dollars okay. the next over the next uh, over the next year, mm -hmm. and obviously we're gonna keep building on that, but I think mm -hmm. we, 10000 is a good foundation mm -hmm. to have for us. And What's the total goal? So the, the total goal, I mean, you know, I don't have that off the top of my head if I get mm -hmm. back to you. Um, yeah, let's say $1 million. It's $1 million. <laughs> 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 um, <laughs> um, you have a long way to go. We do, we do, but you know, at least we're starting now. We wanted okay. to reach out to the people who have been really supporting us over the years, and you're definitely been, you know, one of our greatest supporters oh, in our work. Okay. And, you know, I, I think that this is something that, you know, I, I just wanted to just like throw it out there for you and, you know, let you know that this is happening. And, you know, it would be really great to have your support and, you know, even a contribution of, I don't know, I know you, that you gave, maybe, you know, a thousand dollars for the, for, the, for the fundraiser. You know, if you could, you know, think about maybe, you know, maybe two thousand dollars for this campaign. You know, I think that would be something really great. Yeah. I think it would really certainly you know, expand our work. Right, right. So the whole one million is a total project to build, and this ten thousand is kind of like a seed money, seed capital fundraising thing. Yes. Oh, okay. So we have sort of a, a longer term plan right. in action yeah. right now. I'm, I'm interested in you know, a cultural aspect, so maybe. Are you trying to uh, have us in a cultural loop within the senior housing? That is definitely part okay. of what we're, we're looking to do. Oh, um, okay. And I think that you know, if we had our own space in the senior in the senior apartment with uh, with a, a, a larger, better room for people to practice their their performances in, I think that it would just make our program that much stronger. Mm -hmm. I think you're totally right on it. Yeah, yeah. It sounds great. You know, senior housing. You know, many seniors they are waiting. And then you are trying to build seniors. That, that sounds a really exciting project. And yeah, uh, 
Send me some information. Send me some information and yeah, let me talk to me about that. Great. Okay. When's the next time I should follow up yeah, with you? Maybe, you know, I uh, want you to send me an email about your time availability and then some more information and I definitely look into it. It sounds very uh, exciting project and I'm really interested. Great. I will send you something right away. Okay. Very good. Excellent. Stay there, you guys. Stay there. Okay, that was great. Excellent. Oh. No, you did, that was great. How did it feel to be the donor? Oh, so good. Yeah. <laughs> he gave you a lot of openings. So this is really good. I really like cultural things. It's really very good. How did it feel to be the person asking him? Uh, that, that question about that specific number, I was kind of tumbling in my head with people. So that was a good thing. We're so grateful that you were willing to ask me Okay, so you know her age right now then, you know you've got, you know them. She's a young professional. Yeah, professional. and did she know her? Have they met before? They were introduced by the mother. Excellent, okay, good. And what is it I'm raising for, just, just regular? Uh, or is it a particular campaign? Or? It doesn't make, make believe yeah. Okay, all right. Okay. Um, I just went by. <laughs> Hello? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so glad to finally meet you. Your mother talks about you endlessly. Yeah, she is my so mom proud talks of about you endlessly. <laughs> <laughs> All good, I hope. <laughs> she is such a treasure. She she does so much. Yeah. I don't know where she gets the energy. I don't know either. Yeah. She's a she's my role model. I oh. have so much respect for my mom. Oh. She's ours too, actually. I mean, she's like our dead mother when she works here. She takes care of everybody. Mm -hmm. She has ten times the energy of all the young people. I, think that, I tell you that much. Right. I don't know what we do without her. So she told me about you know what you do uh -huh. and that you think alike and your views are very much alike. And we are trying to raise, raise money for the projects that she's been working on. And she said definitely uh, go, go talk to you. I have no idea what she's doing at Kessie. I know she spends a lot of time at Kessie, but you know. Well, it's divided half and half. Some of it is youth services, but predominantly she's working with other seniors. Okay. And she's trying to mobilize and, and, and advocate for, for, as you know, like just like your mom, first generation, um, not English speaking, um, mm -hmm. but they need services. And you know the budget situation. Things keep getting cut. Mm -hmm. And so the seniors are having to rely on community agencies like us. Yeah. So, yeah. So, And there's a new project that's coming up. It has to do with housing for the income seniors and your mother's been um, really helpful with that so we're trying to yeah we're trying to raise an additional let's see just to get us started um, just another 30,000 will get us through that second phase mm -hmm. and then we're going to be asking for larger grants from governments and other foundations mm -hmm. but from smaller donors wow. if we show that there is a, a, a large community of concerned citizens who are willing to donate right. small large <laughs> whatever right. amount um, that would help us, um, put, uh, it would make the, uh, the grant process a lot easier. Does that make sense? Yeah, no, uh, uh, my mom loves her neighbors. Mm -hmm. uh, and then only through this, you know, senior housing, I think that, um, yeah, she has that sense of community and then like she, she lives independently because, you know, she has so many friends. And then, yeah, she, uh, it's, it's a great, you know, resource for my family, uh, you know, yeah. And that's exactly what the housing program is. It's so that they can have independent living. I mean, mm -hmm. most seniors want to age gracefully. They don't want to be shut up into some home. Oh, yeah. And so, yeah. But we're also going to make sure that the, the senior housing will have um, um, community areas. And we'll make sure that there's intergenerational programs so okay. that young kids that we teach right now at KRC, they're mm -hmm. learning to drum and <laughs> speaking uh, Korean. Uh -huh. They can also um, do that at the senior centers in their community rooms mm -hmm. and participate so that the kids are also exposed to elders as well right. and learn right. Korean culture that way as well. So this is a really important project. So do you think you can help contribute to the our goal? Right, so like uh, uh, what's different like, you know, uh, levels that people can, like individuals like me can make a contribution? Well, we've, we've identified 50 of young professionals just like you mm -hmm. that are uh, already either members of KRC or have relatives like your mother right. that are part of the KRC uh, family. And we figured that if, oh, my math is rough, 30,000 divided by 50 would be 
6,000? 6, 6,000, okay. So 6,000, uh -huh. um, and if that seems too steep, you know, whatever, you can manage to help right. us, you know. And if you know other other people within your company, people within your circle of friends that can help meet that 6,000, right. that would be wonderful. I see. Um, uh, <laughs> <laughs> it's more than My I thought. Is shaky, but, um, uh, I, like, I never really, like, donated to Korean organization before, but then I have a, you know, like, you know, list of, uh, like, non-profit organization I support annually. So that uh, it will be, uh, you know, stretched from uh, my financial situation that uh, uh, to make a 6,000 donation, uh, and you know, in addition to like you know, other organization I think we care about. So, um, but uh, I mean like, you know, uh, I have other, you know, friends in, uh, uh, in the professional field, you know, who are better off and, you know, should really, you know, I should really care about um, uh, my people first, you know, per se. You know, like it's my mom who's, yeah. you know, who's so in love with this organization. So. Uh, I will consider. I mean, I feel like, um, I mean, I throw this, you know, like house party with, you know, uh, my friends. Right. So that, uh, I mean, you know, if you can come back and then, uh, like, you know, like, kind of do like a little introduction about this in a new senior housing project. Um, I will contact my friends and then throw a party and see, you know, what comes That's, out of it. That is a wonderful, wonderful thing to do. Um, there's another uh, member, Susan Kim. Her dad is part of our senior group, uh -huh. and she did exactly that, and she raised eight thousand. All right. Mm -hmm. All right. Then uh, maybe I can talk to her. Yeah. <laughs> and she had a lot of fun, and she made um, she made connections that she didn't know. But you you you've heard on the news recently with the John and Ken, you know, you know scenario. You know that the Asian community. We work hard, I but really we're not always. What you're oh, about. Well, <laughs> well, you know how there's ongoing prejudice and racism against immigrants, and and there seems to be when in times of like economic downturn, uh -huh. people tend to scapegoat, and so uh, we we are one of the jobs. I guess one of the the things that we do at KRC is not only to provide service, but also to advocate <laughs> for our community. So as you say, as part of the Korean American community, you want to be a part of that and you want to support. So. Thank yeah. you so much. Thank you. All right, great. Great. All right, thanks, thanks. Okay, so. I don't know what to say. <laughs>